I thought it was super cool in the book that you mentioned uh, you were the kind of one of the ones to bring up the word cruiserweight and uh, in, incorporate cruiserweights almost as an idea in, in WCW. And you even thought about doing a one fall pin count for cruiserweights. Is that true? Yeah. That's, that's right. That's pretty awesome. That's awesome. That's awesome. But, uh, you know, I still think it's a good idea, but they still haven't uh, really developed a cruiser way. It could be a whole totally different organization. Mm hmm. And with those body types and how everybody's a lot kind of smaller nowadays, and the, the movement in the ring is a lot quicker, and the athleticism is a, is a lot more. Uh, you know, high high notch and high highly elevated. It's 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 pretty. Yeah, that would be uh, you know, it's, uh, actually given the division. Yeah, yeah. You know, and uh, give the division of one ninety five or less. It could still work. It could absolutely still work. Uh, actually, Court Bowers MLB. Yeah, yeah. Court Bowers. Because of their ability to move quicker and. They really can, since you take a 195 athlete, and he's going to be able to, you know, he, he gets some awful speeches. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Totally. And, you know, Court Bowers MLW kind of does that. They have a middleweight division, so it's anybody, I think, I think it's under 200 pounds? Court Bowers uh, Major League Wrestling, they do that, where they have a middleweight division. And so it's all the lighter people. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty cool to see, too. That's pretty cool. Well, you know, it's uh, Mexico. Mm-hmm. It does a great job with it. Yeah. And the... Huge, phenomenal amounts of people. Oh, for sure. For sure. And, like, all the talent that comes out of there is just amazing, too. Like, diverse amount of talent, too. That's what's great. Um, yeah. Yeah, 100%.